Now we're going to cut the fringes on our super easy poncho. We're going to start at the corner because that's the most difficult place. And I've drawn a guide here to show you how to make the cuts. Now as you can see on the guide, at the corner the fringes are cut at an angle and there are longer cuts. Our fringes are going to be two and a half inches long and at the corner it's just a little bit longer. Now you can draw it out like this to get a good feel for how you're going to cut. Another way to, to do it is to measure the two and a half inch fringe and find the midpoint between this side and this side, two and a half inches from here and two and a half inches from here and place a pin there. Then about an inch from the corner, from the very tip of the, the poncho corner, place your ruler or you can even take a, a marker. I don't like to use a marker because then you have to wash it after. But you're going to cut along this line leaving about a half inch, no less than a half inch between the, the, um, the cuts. Okay, you're going to have a cut here and a cut here. Okay, so you can, okay, there's a cut. This is our center, so I've done a little, um, le a little less than a half inch there, starting an inch from the corner. Okay, and that's our first corner fringe. Now, then, now you want to sort of ease this. You don't want this to be much bigger than an inch. So you start at an inch here and then you want to get up to the two and a half inch there. So you just kind of angle it a little, making sure that it's about a half inch or more at the top of the fringe. And then as you come around the corner, you want it to straighten out. And then eventually all your fringes are going to be straight. And the fringes that we're doing are um, three quarters of an inch wide. And then continue cutting the fringe until you get close to the corner again. About um, four and a half or five inches from the corner and then we'll cut the next corner.